This video does not call for violence. The video includes scenes of feeding aquarium inhabitants. The real adventure awaits you today. We're opening the beach season and going to a desert island that will be colonized by hundreds of pioneer cockroaches. Many predatory sea monsters live off the coast of this island. But let's start with the backstory. This uninhabited island should have an underground prison, where pioneer cockroaches will hide in the future. The underground prison was built from hundreds of stone bricks, and the most important thing was to develop special steps that could easily descend into this stone dungeon. Of course, the walls of the prison must be strong to withstand any natural conditions, such as moisture coming from the depths of the island, as well as the huge load that the walls will receive from all sides, since the dungeon will be almost at sea level. Stone bricks were laid with a special strong salmon mortar according to ancient technology taking into account all possible technical solutions of that time. The prison even has a fire pit that can light up the darkest place in the castle. Indeed, there once was a castle on the surface of the island, but unfortunately it did not survive, since in those days there were many pirate attacks on the island for the purpose of profit. There were really difficult times for the castle and its inhabitants. One of the shells fired from the ship's cannon finally destroyed the castle on the surface. The island began to be particularly overgrown with various vegetation. Initially, there were practically no living creatures of the coast of this island. But hundreds of years later, due to global climate change, many marine and dangerous inhabitants began to gradually appear in the sea. A little later, another large monster appeared. It differed in color and was more aggressive. These three monsters constantly divided the territory of the coast among themselves. If you watch them, you can see their unfriendly intentions. Some time later, huge predator fish appeared. It could drag any cockroach under the water. These fish are ready to wait for prey of the coast of the island for hours. I'm even afraid to imagine what will happen to a cockroach if it gets on the surface of the sea. Well, as soon as these huge monsters with close sea fish in front of them, they begin to hunt for it. It turns out that the island is dangerous not only for cockroaches, but also for all the inhabitants that can disappear from the island through natural selections. And just recently, a huge creature appeared on the coast in the sea. It was capable of even destroying ships and dragging entire detachments of colonizers underwater. At the moment, this is the king of all monsters. So, the day came when a hundred colonizing cockroaches reached the island and began to populate it. Due to the long journey by sea, the cockroaches ran out of all their food and water supplies. Some of their team lost their minds out of hopelessness and began to run to the coast of the island to drink seawater. Another part of the cockroach team was evaluating the destruction of the castle and using their modern engineering ideas to decide how best to restore the castle. Many cockroaches were preoccupied with finding fresh water, but unfortunately exploring the island would take longer than they expected. So more and more cockroaches appeared on the seashore, which were very thirsty. At this time, the smallest monster was sneaking up to them from the depth of the sea, which had so far been watching the new settles and probably studying their weak points for a better attack in the future. Another, more aggressive monster hunted predator fish that hid in the reefs of the sea. While the clown monsters were busy with part of the fish, 
one of the most dangerous fish approached the shore of the island. By behavior of the fish, you can see that it is waiting for an annotative cockroach. But the fish are unlucky this time, as the giant crayfish decided to catch all other competitors that might eat cockroaches without its knowledge. It turns out that this island really has many of its secrets and most importantly dangerous and unpredictable moments for cockroaches. Some of the inhabitants of the island are trying to establish connections among themselves in order to catch prey as a team. And then the moment came. The most gigantic monster woke up, which made the first raid on the island. And it's only day and the cockroaches need to somehow survive the first night on the island. So far, the giant crab has given a simple warning to the cockroaches by stealing a huge stone from the castle from them. But for some reason, the cockroaches ignored his warning. In the meantime, the first victim from the detachment of the colonialists appeared, which was carried into the sea by huge coastal waves. And of course, within a few hours, the giant crab made many raids on the island, but the cockroaches continued to ignore it and go about their business. Until their first night came. For eight hours of living on the island, the cockroaches had a hard time. Their ship was sunk with part of the crew. Most likely unique battles took place to save the ship. But the cockroaches lost the opportunity to swim away from the island. Many colonialists even flooded on the surface of the sea. But even that is not all. The main problems of the cockroaches were waiting on the island itself. A giant crab caused multiplied destructions overnight. And all only because the cockroaches ignored dozens of his warnings to leave the island. During this difficult night, dozens of missing colonizers appeared. The main part of the cockroach team hid on the highest palm tree. Now it became clear to cockroaches that jokes with a huge crab can end badly. In fact, many more interesting events would take place on this island. Actually, it's only the first 24 hours on the island. Imagine what happens in a week. I hope you enjoy this format. We have spent a lot of time and made an effort to find this island for you. Therefore, do not be too lazy to like this video. By the way, do you think this rowdy crap should be excluded from the game? The destruction he inflicted on the island in one day cannot be compared to what he can do in a week. To do this, we came up with an interactive for you. In this story, you decide how life will continue on this island. If you think that the crab should be removed, write in the comments, remove the crab. If you think that the crab should stay, write, leave the crab.